Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? It's Big P here, yeah? you know don't you, you know, the voice of hardcore boxing fans. I'm the guy that says things that no other YouTuber dare say, because they all want access don't they? Dare say a word, they don't say anything, but I'm stupid enough to say it aren't I? <laughs> Look, we're not in this to make pals are we? I've got enough friends. So, right, here we go. Tom Little versus Dave Allen. Must happen. Do you know why? I think it's a good fight. I think it's a good fight. Where's Dave Allen heading? Where's where's he heading, David? Where's where's Dave Allen heading? Where's he heading? Where? Where? He's not heading anywhere, is he, at the moment? He's on Skid Row. <laughs> As regards his boxing career, he's, he's like the forgotten man of matchroom, isn't he, Dave? Now, I want to see him fight Tom Little. Dave can't be calling out Babic, because that's an easy night's work for Dave, isn't it? Knocking cruiserweights about and on, on a Sky show and, you know, pretending you're a big star for the week. That's not good. We want to see you in a proper fight. And Tom Little against Dave Allen's a proper, proper fight. It's like Dennis has just said to me the other day. Tom Little is a capable fighter. He just hasn't been dedicated enough, has he? But I think Tom Little, you, you get a proper camp partner him, and if he's training alongside somebody who, who he knows, and, and they're having a bit of banter, I can see Tom Little putting a, putting a good camp together and setting about Dave Allen and punching him upside down. But I can also see Dave punching Tom upside down. That's why it's a great fight. You've got two big personalities, and let's have it right. Pair of, pair of them haven't won a belt yet. They've not won so much as a central area belt. But yet you've got Dave there talking about fighting Babic, a 4 and 0 guy. Is he 4 and 0? Something like that. Yeah, had many fights. And uh, Or you've got him talking about fighting Debar, wanting X amount to fight Debar and blah de blah. And he were, he were chasing down Povetkin one here last year or something. What 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 rubbish is that? What what bullshit's that? Could you imagine what Povetkin would have done to Dave Allen? Dave Allen, it would have it would have took the rest of them brain cells out in his head, wouldn't it? Dave's already talking like Riddick Bow. So I think he should avoid people like Povetkin. I think he should go back to the beginning, get a central area belt, and then an English, then a British. Go through the levels, find your level. You can't just go from being area level to fighting guys that are uh, Louis Ortiz type guys, you can't do that. Find your level. Oh, we'll fight Tony Yoker in France, Olympic gold medalist, six foot seven. Punched him upside down. Why would you do that? What sort of person's advising you to fight people like him or Ortiz or David Price? And who's advising Dave Allen? Go back to the very beginning, Dave. You've got talent. Go back and show your talent. And be dedicated. I don't want to hear all these, oh, look at shape I'm in and all that. We've heard all that before, Dave. Operation White Rhino 8.5 or something. We've heard all that. Tom Little is your level. Cash Al is your level. Fight them people. All right? Stop dreaming about being on big shows and all this and blah, 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 headlining. You fluked it, headlining, Dave. Fluked boxing. You've, you've, you're ahead of the game. You're very sharp. You're very shrewd. You know how to manipulate social media. But as regards what you've won, you haven't won a belt yet. So I'll go back to the beginning and let's see some belts built up. I'm not talking them stupid trinket belts. We're talking area English British Commonwealth. If you can start off with one of them, if you get an area or an English. Fight Tom Little, I think it's a great fight. I think Tom Little's probably English stroke British level. Tom Little, matched correctly, could get a British title. Could. But he's got to beat people like Dave Allen and Cash Alley. But I like Tom Little. I met him in Bulgaria. We had a good chat. He's a very respectful young man. and He can punch as well and he's tough. And I don't want to see Tom Little thrown in with any big dogs like Dave Allen's been. Because... In years to come, Eddie Earn will still be driving around in a Rolls Royce and, it, and, and life might not work out for people like Tom Little and Dave Allen. And, and 20 years down the line, if it don't work out, they'll not even be able to get a ticket off Eddie Earn to come boxing without having to pay. 
So let's start looking after these young lads that are coming through as heavyweights. I don't want to see them busted up. I don't want to see Cheeseburn and Eggington smashed to bits for people's amusement. I want to see them brought on. Although to be fair they've got uh, Eggington, British Commonwealth and European. So, and I think Cheeseman's ended up winning a British, hasn't he? So, but I want to see Tom Little and Dave Allen win some belts now and put in with guys at their level. That's what I want to see because they're likeable lads, Dave Allen and Tom Little. I don't want to see them just fed for Olympians, thrown in with Wolves to get smashed up. I don't want to see that. The managers of these people should be ashamed. Sometimes need, needs must and you've got to do it for money, but I want to see Tom Little against Dave Allen. And the winner of that, I think, should fight for a British title. Tom Little against Dave Allen, British title eliminator, or an area belt, or an English. I want to see, that's what I want to see. I want to see, I don't want to see a WBA Continental or something like that. I don't want to see that. I want to see them go through the proper levels. Area, English, British, Commonwealth, European world. I want to know what level they're at. I don't just want to see them thrown in with guys that are Euro stroke world level and coming out of the ring all smashed to bits. I don't want to see that. Alright, I don't want to see that. Alright, I want to see Tom Little, Dave Allen. It must happen. Eddie Hearn, get your check out. Get these kids paid, whatever you want to pay them, 30 or 40 grand a piece. Get them in the ring and get them fighting. Get them looked after. Alright, they've put the time in. They deserve to fight each other because from what I'm hearing, Dave Allen needs to watch his back because if Tom bumps into him at a show, it could go off. Tom Little's got bombs in his hand. When he lets that left go, Tom Little, it's KO. So be careful, Dave. All right, peace out. Keep on trucking, keep sporting boxing. Don't have nightmares.